So it is Fashion Friday again and I have decided to go ahead and do the requested video of my tights collection. It's not super huge but I thought I would go ahead and do that and I also will be addressing a video request um, at the end of the video. So okay, um, this first pair of tights are my absolute favorite and I actually have it in my styling with tights video which you can see me wearing them um, in the link down below. But yeah, I'm just going to show you guys what they look like right now and they are just these brown cotton and they're really warm and sorry they got some like fur on them right now and they're so so cute and I would really love to go get myself like a gray pair of these uh, I really think these are a good thing to have especially since winter's coming so definitely consider getting yourself some good like proper cotton tights um and then I have, you know, just of course your typical black tight. Um, you know, just very, very typical. I think pretty much everybody has these in their wardrobe. I think it's kind of a necessity. And then, lastly, I do really like like really sophisticated looking colorful tights. I'm not really into like really, really bold patterns or really, really bright colors for tights, but I do like this purple. I think it's really nice. And um, I think it's a good way to kind of make a really plain dress. Like I was wearing a really plain gray dress. I thought it was a really good way to kind of make it pop. And then I put a purple scarf and I'll, that's also in my styling with tights video. So um, definitely go check that out if you're interested to see how I worked with that. But I really like it and I'd really like to get myself like a nice berry or um, like wine colored pair of tights. Okay, and now for the video request. Um, so it was requested from a fashion student that I give her some ideas on how to make pantyhose modern. Um, and I really had a hard time with it because, I mean, it's for her project. And I really want to help you out, but I have to admit that I do not like pantyhose at all. And um, I think it really depends though. I mean, I don't mind like black pantyhose. I just really don't like the nude ones and I think that's kind of what you were hoping I would help you out with. Um, but yeah, so I was looking around kind of trying to find inspiration for it and actually one of the people who I am studying with right now came to school wearing a pair of like really cute like beige um, shorts and she had on a pair of nude pantyhose and then up to her knees she was wearing like gray stockings and I thought that was kind of weird but it, it didn't look too bad on her um it might sound crazy but yeah so yeah I was like well maybe I could do something similar like that and I know of a website called stylefruits.de where you can like make your own um outfits like create your own outfits out of a whole bunch of clothes it's a really really fun website I'll put the link down below but everything is in German so I have to apologize about that um but yeah so I decided to go on there and kind of see what they had and see what kind of outfit I could put together that was kind of inspired by this girl but only I put my own little modern twist on it so I'll go ahead and I'll insert the the picture right now and then I'll just do a voiceover for the rest of the video. Okay everyone, so here is the outfit that I put together from stylefruits.de and um, as you can see in the middle there is the pantyhose and they have polka dots on them and I thought that was really cool and I thought that was quite modern in itself. So those are quite a modern um, way to wear pantyhose, um, you know, just with some nice pattern. They are kind of a nudish white pantyhose. I think they could go really either way, um, so I thought that was just kind of cool. And um, I don't know if I would personally wear them, but you know, I think this would be a really, really fun way to wear them if I would consider wearing pantyhose. So, okay, um, and then I took the inspiration from the girl from my class. I decided to pair it with some beige shorts. And um, yeah, I think these shorts are really, really cute. I actually want to go get myself a pair of these like really soon. I think that they're so cute. You can wear them totally in the fall and in the winter time. Um, okay. And then for the top, I always think of like polka dots as like a really, really girly kind of romantic thing. So I decided to go with like a really nice red long sleeve top. It's quite casual, but it's got some nice ruffle detail in there that I think makes it really, really cute. And now for the accessories. And I think accessories are really the most important part in order to make pantyhose modern because doing a lot of accessorizing is really, really modern, I think. I mean, at least these days, people are really, really into accessorizing. So I decided to definitely put a scarf in there. And this is just a really nice black scarf. And it's actually got some little sparkly detail on it. And I thought that was really cute. Some really romantic um, earrings that are red and they have like um, silver on them. And then the shoes, I think you can go either way. Um, I do think flats would be a good idea because I do find these 
pantyhose to be quite romantic looking that's at least the way I look at it anyways so I think you could go with either like a really nice black um flat or a really plain one because because the pantyhose do really already have a lot going on in them, but I did try to pair the pantyhose with just some black flats or with some like nude ones, but I found that these red ones with the really nice flower on it just really worked the best. And I kind of like the idea because, you know, I have a red top in there. Why not add a little bit more red? Why not just have a little bit of fun? Um, and I think flats are really quite modern too. So I think definitely go with flats. I don't think I would go with too many other different shoes with these kinds of tights I just think that they go the best and then of course like something that's really modern is lip gloss just a plain super sparkly lip gloss and this one happens to be from Lavera and it's I don't know what it's called I'm sorry I'll put the link down below but it's a really nice like crazy sparkly lip gloss and that's insanely modern so I would definitely go with that and that is an all natural lip gloss, of course, you guys know me. And then if you do like to wear nail polish, I would go with like a really, really quite modern thing. Like I think right now people are really quite into like black nails. And this is a really like quite natural nail polish compared to most of the nail polishes out there. It's from a line called Butter. And it's kind of like a goldy black with a lot of sparkles in it. And I thought that looked really cool and modern and I thought it really went good with the red. So that was just my little idea on how I would wear pantyhose. I think it's quite a romantic outfit. It's really, really different. I don't see too many people walking around in this, but I definitely think it would work. And then, of course, if you're not into the whole pairing pantyhose with shorts maybe like a nice black skirt would be like a little bit more chic for you but I thought this would be kind of a funner way to wear it because I don't know I just wanted to come up with something kind of different but I think I would even personally prefer like a nice black skirt with these pantyhose to be honest so I hope you enjoy this and I really really hope that I helped help the fashion student out definitely let me know if this helped you and I will talk to you guys soon bye